Um, yes, a migrant body. Uh, I'm from Africa and I live in Italy and I think I'm part of this continent, the African continent, where people are living, coming in Europe uh, to look for a good, a best life, a job. And I left also Africa for some other problems. I had some political problems. And so I think I'm a migrant body. And uh, I have also to continue being a migrant body because I have to, um, to bring this message, uh, a, a good message that something can change to other people in the world. I'm a migrant body because uh, I'd like to do something so uh, the situation of migrant people can change, especially in Italy. So in Europe, but especially in Italy, because I live in Italy and uh, the condition of people coming here, uh, conditions are not really good. So for example, people asking for the status of refugees, uh, they don't find the good answer here. Uh, people are dying when they arrive, for example, in Lampedusa or before arriving in Lampedusa and they leave their countries uh, because they are wars, they are bombs. And I have to explain to all people, especially young people in schools, universities, that who left Africa or Asia coming in Europe um, and are not people coming to colonize Europe or take job to European. They escape from something really bad. They escape from bombs, bombs that were created by Europeans. So, and we go, we as European, as people of Western world, we organize wars, wars in these countries to take, for example, energy, to take minerals. So that's why I think that a migrant body, I have to continue working and bring this message of peace everywhere. What's your destination right now and why? So right now, today we are in uh, Bassano del Grappa. Uh, I'm going now to Udine. Pordenone Udine, then uh, uh, Trieste, and after I leave Italy, continuing in Europe, Slovenia, uh, uh, Vienna, uh, Republic, uh, Republic Czech, Czech Republic, uh, Slovakia, Poland, Lithuania, Lithuania, Estonia, and then um, uh, Helsinki. So this trip, this walk is from Reggio Emilia to Helsinki Why? for peace, for peace, not only peace in Congo, because I'm from Congo. Uh, I'm telling people how Congolese people are, are used because uh, we have a mineral, a special mineral called coltan, which is used for mobile phones, for example, tablets, computers. And it's uh, uh, a bed, a blood mineral. So our mobile phones are blood mobile phones. But now I'm not speaking only for Cong um, about Congo. I speak about all countries suffering from war. war. And this, this work has been dedicated to Nepal uh, because uh, I have the opportunity to speak with many people and I want these people to help uh, other, uh, our sister and brothers from Nepal suffering today. So uh, it's a message of peace and it's a message of hope. You are a peace walking man. What's the impact on people? What's the reaction? The reaction is really positive, especially in young people. Uh, while making this interview, a young, a ch a children, young, a young people stopped here asking what we were doing. And I said, we are speaking about peace. And maybe he's 
still waiting, I don't know, because he wants to tell, to ask more information. So young people are really interested on what we are doing, because uh, sometimes we say that they are the future, and we have to give them information, instruments, so tomorrow they can be really the future. And uh, they are really, they are interested to know what uh, they can do for peace. And the question sometimes is, what can I do now that I saw this? All the uh, older people, sometimes they say, so we have the crisis, I don't mind because this and this. But young people, every time they want to know, and sometimes they come also to do some kilometers with me. So, uh, but in general, in general, uh, people give a positive answer, positive, um, uh, yes, positive answer, answer. Last question. Um, what's your message uh, to deliver to the project Migrant Bodies, which uh, will be in July? Okay, I think I met first the first time, uh, I don't remember, two years ago. Two years ago, the Migrant body, Bodies here, I think it was also July. I think I came from Brussels, directed to Bassano del Grappa, and I think I spent two fantastic days here speaking with people from all the world. That's really important. It's an international, international project. That's how we have to act. Because sometimes we, we look only on our um, local site, but we have to make international our messages. Last time I said to people, so this message you have to bring it to your countries. So, now that uh, um, I'm really sorry that I, can be, I can't be with you, uh, I told uh, Roberto, it's not possible to come back because I'll be really so far from here. But the message is, try to do the same. When you go back in your countries, try to bring this message, the message of peace. Tell people that things can change. Peace can come, but we have to have the hope and we have to believe in it. And of course, we have to do something to walk and walk. If you, I don't know, it's, there are different ways to, to walk, but who can walk can do it. But uh, also, sending messages is like walking. Okay, so when you go back in your countries, please bring this message of peace. Nothing is po impossible. Everything, if you want, we can realize it. My, a miracle can be realized by many people. And I think Gandhi said, be the change you want to see in the world. So we have to be the change. I don't have to, ask, uh, to wait for my neighbor to do something because maybe the neighbor is waiting for me too so we have to do everything we have to do everything to change together the world and it's possible thank you thank you